Okay, today we're going to learn how to try to find missing angle measures in more than one shape. So I'm going to read the directions first. A, B, C, D is a trapezoid, and I need to find the measure of angle A, D, E, and angle F, C, B. So I'm just going to start by marking those. A, D, E. So that's A is over here, D is over here, and E is over here. That's this whole angle over here. I know that this part here is 119, but that's angle A, D, C. So I need to find out a little bit more over here to be able to figure that angle out. I also need F, C, B. So I'm going to look down at the bottom to F, C, B. That's this outer angle that I'm trying to find. So I'm going to begin by filling in some things that I already know. So this is a trapezoid, and I know in a trapezoid adjacent sides add up to 180 degrees. So I'm going to look at this angle that equals 119, and I'm going to try and find this missing angle over here. So to do that, I know that adjacent angles equal 180. I subtract 180 from 119, and I get 61 degrees. So this angle is 61 degrees. Another thing that I know is that this is a straight line. So if this is a straight line, I know that these two angle measures together have to add up to 180 degrees. So I can do some more subtraction there. 180 minus 61 equals 119 degrees. So now if I'm inside the triangle DCE, let's just highlight that a little bit. Triangle DCE. I know that there are 180 degrees inside that triangle. And I've already used up 119 and 22. I have to figure out how much are left for angle CDE, this little angle here. So in order to do that, I have to add up my 119, my 22. 119 plus 22, and you get 141. So that means that I've used 141 degrees inside that triangle D, C, E. Now I need to subtract 180 because there are 180 degrees inside the triangle from 141. My answer is 39 degrees. So that's this little angle over here. 39 degrees. I still have not found out that measure for angle ADE. In order to do that, I need to add these two together. So, 119 and 39. I'll add them together. And I get 158 degrees. So, angle ADE is equal to 158 degrees. I'm still not done now. I'm still missing this angle measure here on the outside. Interesting. As I look at this, I see I almost have a circle. Pretty cool. So I know that there are 360 degrees inside a circle. I also know by looking at this, that this triangle here is an equilateral triangle. And I know that every angle measure in an equilateral triangle is 60 degrees. Now I'm getting somewhere. So now I have three angle measures out of the total four that I need. So in order to figure out C, I need to add up 60 plus 119 plus 61 and then subtract from 360. 6 plus 1 is 7, 6 plus 1 is 7, 7 plus 7 is 14. I have 260, 200, excuse me, 240 degrees. So now I'm going to take this 240 and subtract it from 360. 360 minus 240 equals 120 degrees. Angle FCB equals 120 degrees. Awesome. Good job. Good luck with your homework.